Okay, in this video we're going to have a go at using Ben Sound to find some music to match the um, text-to-speech output that we produced in the last session. But before we do this, we need to know how long our MP3 we've already produced is. So I'm going to go back on, I'm going to choose the one I did with the South African voice. I'm just going to double click on it. The station. Okay, and it says it's 1 minute and 12 seconds long. Okay. Now on bensound.com, I'm going to go to free music. I'm going to use this one because this is music that you're legitimately allowed to use as long as you reference it. So I'm going to click on free music. And I'm going to go down here to duration. Now it doesn't need to be as the exact length of the poem. It would be quite nice if some music played first and then we had a poem and some music at the end or if we even broke the poem up and spread it amongst the music. But I certainly don't need eight minutes. I'm going to take this down to about it. Two and a half, three minutes. There we go, that's about right. And I'm going to press apply. And you'll see as we go down, there's a whole range of different music here. So I can listen to Cozy Coffee House, Melancholy Lull. You can work through, you can listen to them, and you can see which one best matches your poem. The one I want to try is this one. fits my poem quite well. So I'm going to press on free download. Now it says free license with attribution. So you need to download the music, but you also need to get the attribution text. So we're going to click download music and get attribution text. You can see the files downloading into my downloads folder. So I'm going to press save, but I'm also going to copy the uh, attribution text here. And then I'm going to paste this into Word, into the same file I was using before, so that I can come back to it later. So I'm going to go back into the station. I'm going to scroll right down to the bottom. You can see I've done this once before. I can replace that with new attribution tags that matches the bits we've just done. And then that's saved there. And if I now go into here, I go back into my downloads, you should see I've now got sat down. I can click on that and I can listen to this. vocals on. This should make a nice background piece of music for the station in Paris poem that we created before. 